right, so so one final thing I want to hit on, and y'all tell me how funny this is to y'all. Y'all medical company known as Pfizer. <laughs> the Pfizer foolishness. Do you see how much stuff is coming out about this company right now? They are taking hits yeah. left, right, and center. I mean, they have had the last what decade, what think two or three large lawsuits. I think it was one four hundred something million. I think the last one was like a billion. I think. Uh, so, I mean, they, they don't have a clean record. No, they don't. But the beauty about this is they are now getting lambasted for uh, for all their COVID crap. I think this is rather funny because if I could do, if I could pull a boy nerd Roddy, I would cue Razor Fist. Fuck you! I was right! Fuck you! I was right! Fuck you! I was right! Because how long have we been telling everybody? Mm-hmm. Say, man, something is wrong with it. This, this, this ain't right. Frosty yeah. hit me to this when Frosty told me that Pfizer had in their um, deal with the government making this vaccine that right. they could not be held liable. Whoa. Uh, Say what? Exactly. When Frosty told me that, I'm out. I'm out. I mean, I, I, my, my doctors have been on me for real. Hey, man, you have all these issues. You really might want to get it. You really might want to get it. And I thought about it. And then bro told me, well, you know, Pfizer said that if anything go wrong, they're not held. They're not, uh, they're not liable. I'm out. But y'all, that means y'all don't stand behind y'all product. I'm out. Yeah, I'm seeing all these kids and these healthy people, athletes, having they dropping dead or having dropping. Dropping. Like, dropping. And, and they're trying to cover it up. The media is trying to black it out as fast, fast as they can. It get out, and then it get quiet. Get out, and then it get quiet. It's like, look at all these athletes, these these teenagers and these 20-year-olds and 30-year-olds just dropping. I'm like, yeah, right. Man, and, and that is, to me, I, 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 all the – all the things that have been, have been coming out over the last eight months, like when they came out and finally said, "Oh, we didn't do any human, we didn't do any human trials before we released it to the public." Of Wait, course. what? Yeah, y'all, y'all, what? They rushed it, and then they and then they tried to walk it back. Oh, well, we never said that you couldn't catch it. Oh, bull. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Y'all both said that if, if anybody got this shot, y'all couldn't catch it. Y'all were going to be immune to it. They're, you're okay. You're not going to. You're not going to get COVID if you have these vaccinations. Let me emphasize that if you are vaccinated, you have a very high degree of protection. You know what? Interesting. Here's a go. I was wondering what this meant. I just looked it up. The it was, it was back in 2009, the last time they've settled uh, Pfizer, and it was for off-label promotion and kickbacks. And I, I'm like, well, okay, what is off-label promotion? I looked it up. Basically, is when they promote or through maybe the sales channel that mm-hmm. a medication can do something that was not approved by the FDA. Like for example, they say, hey, we got a blood pressure medicine, but then they're like, hey, hey, tell the tell the the, the chain that it also works with migraines, or telling doctors, salespeople, it works for this, this, and this. But we didn't get approved for that. So that's one of the things that they, and that was like a $2.3 billion uh, settlement. Oh, it's crazy wow. some drugs it. work like that because I, I know I'm off, off, off. No, 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 no keep going, keep going. It triggered something. I remember when mom and, uh, you know, the girls, uh, you know, y'all know what I'm talking about, the girls. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. And I remember that they would take a certain type of, uh, what do you call that, sinus medicine? Mm-hmm. But you would take the size minutes to actually grow things. They're like, okay, because they're they skinny girls. So they're like, I need to put on some weight because X, Y, Z. They'll go, mom will get them. Hey, you know what? You know, you 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 doing this, doing this. Uh, I'm I'm getting too skinny. So they'll start taking that sinus medicine and they boobs get bigger, they butt get bigger. I'm like, the hell? And she said, yeah. I'm like, that was one of the side effects. I'm like, why in the hell is a sinus medicine making stuff grow on you like that? It always blew my mind. Then the girls stop taking it for a while, I guess, because they just don't want to. They get too heavy or whatever. They just like don't like it. And every now and then they'll go right back to it. And for you know, up, my boobs are bigger. Up, my butt has gotten back bigger. I'm like, the hell. But like when you said that, be that reminds me of that. 
what 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 mm. what, what happened? I'm like, I didn't know that stuff was true. You just that just triggered an old memory. I'm sorry. No, nah, man, because you understand that is essentially how Viagra got discovered. That's true. Viagra got discovered as a blood pressure medication. Yeah, that's true. I remember that. Yeah, like I said, you don't know, but they said they they just they willingly to say, ah, oh, we ain't got time to get it approved through X Y Z, and uh, eh, we'll just uh, say it down the channel, but we're not gonna run it through the the system again. And all I'm looking for is. I, I'm looking for my apology for all those ass clowns. Yeah. Give them said, a little quarter. Yeah. Who? Y'all going to kill people. If y'all don't take this, you're going to kill grandmothers. You're going to. We didn't take it. We're still alive. Uh, I want my apology. Yeah. Uh, well, give us amnesty. No. 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 no, no. You were the, you, some of you people were like saying that that's not only killing other people, but also we're a danger. We should be locked up. And we're a danger to society. Camps. Um, yeah, we're the horrible we should, people. We should not get medical help if we didn't get yeah. the vaccine. Um, we're killing, we're killing, we're killing grandmothers. Uh, we should lose our jobs if we. No, oh no, no, no. If I may take Baby Brother's most famous line, give them no quarter because y'all have earned it. So now, now it's time for y'all to to face what you put out there, or as the old folks in the country used to say, but the thing about them tables. They do turn. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Think about them tables. They do turn. Wait. Stop right there. That was a sample. You want the whole entree? Follow us on our podcast, Free Mind Thinkers. You can find us where you pick up any and all your favorite podcasts. That includes Amazon Music, Pandora, Spotify, Google Podcasts, and iHeartRadio. Until next time, y'all take care of yourselves and always dare to think differently.